What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Steven. This is Steven in Stereo and in today's video we're going to be checking out Post Malone and Blake Shelton doing a collaboration together. The song is called Pour Me A Drink. I'm super excited about this for a lot of reasons. One, I haven't reacted to a lot of Post Malone before. I haven't reacted to a lot on this channel before when it comes to Post Malone. So I'm super excited about that. Also, I love that Post Malone is in his country music era. Um, somebody who grew up in the alternative music but then, you know, found his way with being Post Malone and coming out with White Iverson and everything that he's done since then has been so incredible. So to see him making that full loop, full circle, him being from Texas and now putting out country music is awesome. And of course, Blake Shelton's been around for quite a while. He is a legend in country music and honestly like a household name at this point. So I'm super excited to dive into the song, Pour Me A Drink. I actually really like his voice um, when he does this Southern style. He's got this uh, almost like 90s little uh, inspiration. I feel like a lot of the 90s country singers were singing in a little bit higher of a range. Post, I feel like, finds like a good spot for that with his voice, and it actually works really well. I'm going. Yes, I really Wait, what? So he says, somebody pour me a drink, somebody bum me a smoke. Okay, when he says bum me a smoke, he looks like he would say bum me a smoke right there, doesn't he? Like anyone who's ever come up to you to bum a smoke off, like that's it right there, ready? Right? You're just chilling and this guy comes over. Yep. <laughs> Looking so good these days. Them jeans. also has the right attitude for this because I feel like country music, you know, I, I love to see that like country music's always been about a lot of fun. I feel like there's a lot of emotion in it. There's a lot of tears, a lot of sadness, a lot of beers, trucks, horses, you know, the, you know, the, the routine there, but I feel like it's also always been a lot about fun and partying. And I love that like Post Malone, while he also gives me, you know, a bum a smoke vibe, he also gives me have a good time vibe. So that giving me those like higher range like just that little bit of higher range that he sings with his voice or that higher tone. All of that is just like super elevating. Urban brown eyes trying to get me drunk. Ain't stop until the bottle and the job is done. Hey, I think I might have found my future love. But you should probably buy her one. Somebody pour me a drink. Somebody pour me a smoke. I'm about to get Puzzle just shaking his ass for this whole video. It's the summer country party anthem right here. I can feel it already. If it's not already, I'm probably late to the party. Why is it so fucking catchy though? Oh yeah, great harmony right there. They have such a good mood between the two of them and this. 
kind of slept they actually got together to do the video and like throw a party out in the woods because fuck yeah. Where was that? Oh shit! Oh shit, but he never left the gas station, man. That's how it goes. That's how it goes, man. But also, I love the meaning of the song because like, yeah, you look at just pour me a drink and it's like, oh, it's just about the party. But like, it's really not. What it's really about is just somebody trying to escape the woes of that everyday life. I think that's the thing is sometimes people take lyrics too seriously sometimes to the point that maybe you miss out on on maybe like the bigger picture. And I, I'm, I'm really only uh, saying that implying to like, Sometimes people hear a song like this and be like, oh, it's just a song about drinking. And like, yeah, maybe at, at the base level and there's nothing wrong with that at the base level. Maybe that's what it's about. But I think there's more to it. It's it's the stress of the daily life, the stress of having to work all week, trying so hard, like you said, to keep up with the Joneses. You're trying to you know balance your relationships. There's a lot that's going on. All you're really looking forward to is that moment whenever you can just relax, you can relax, let go, pour a drink and let loose and and that's really what the song is about and i fucking love that i love that it's so up tempo so big for a summer you know it's really fucking hot out right now and i feel like you just want to go out you have the barbecue going you know someone's dad's got the cargo shorts with the um nike monarchs on like you know what's happening they got grass stains and everything there's beer everywhere though you know people are having a great time they're letting loose they're having that moment and they're listening to this song in the background for sure and i feel like country music is so commercially successful it's sickening sometimes um obviously you know when you were selling physicals i feel like they were really dominating but country music is just such a commercial beast and the fact that you know blake shelton has been killing it forever and he's obviously a legend in this so this collaboration is just legendary on so many levels but i also just love that post malone gets in where he fits in in the best way he really is like the chameleon of music and I'm such a fan of that because he's somebody I'd want to be friends with for that reason. Somebody that you can talk music and it doesn't matter what genre comes up or what artists come up. You're going to find a way to relate to that person and that music or you're going to be like excited about it on some level. And I feel like that is him in a nutshell. I see him doing country music. He gets photographed um, like doing stuff with like like punk bands and hardcore bands. He does hip hop and all this other stuff that we just like it never ends. And then he gets a collaboration with Ozzy. Now we're here with Blake Shelton. I'm just a fan. I can't believe that I don't listen to his music. I can't believe I don't react to his music. Like it's crazy considering all the reasons that I just listed below in my speech. So I feel like for that reason alone, uh, we should be checking out more Post Malone, but you guys should let me know in the comment section, how you guys feel about this track? How do you guys feel about Post Malone's you know, journey into the cowboy sunset. You'll have to let me know in the comments. I love you guys all. I will see you in the next one. Peace.